But yeah, the Pokemon Go thing. I know we we've talked about this the last couple weeks. I feel like you're setting things up by calling it the Pokemon <laughs> Go thing. I, know, we're, I mean, we're, the like, phenomenon. Like, Here's what grinds my gears. No, 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 no. We're, no, we're, we're no. like we're like socially obligated to talk about this game yeah, at this point because it blew up in a way it's this weekend. Fucking, it's, it's a phenomenon like I have Dude, maybe like I've never seen. I recorded, so I do that thing for CBS Radio, yeah. where every week I record a minute of fucking whatever. Oh, the Giant Bomb Gaming. The, yeah. Just the Giant Bomb Gaming minute uh, available at GiantBomb.com or syndicated out to 11 million people on the CBS radio network. Uh, and I recorded that like the, a couple of days before the game came out and I spent a week like playing it yeah. and recorded. It. I was like, this thing, it's too shallow. Like it's, it's, it's kind of insulting. Like, are they making it for kids? Cause like it's, it seems like even stripped down, but kids are smart enough to figure out real Pokemon. Why would this thing be this way? And so you can go listen to that. Like, and that thing didn't go up until after it had come <laughs> out. Oh no! So it's a real good. It's real good. Fucking old old man yelling at someone's cloud. Gonna, someone's gonna <laughs> someone's gonna like listen to that in ten years, and it'll be right there next to the articles. It's like this internet's never gonna yeah. do a damn thing. <laughs> um, no one's gonna shop online. Well, I mean, we'll see what kind of legs. It oh has. yeah, like it's yeah, it's yeah. been out for what five days. I mean, in the I, US? I, I right. stand by but, like everything as it being yeah. a super shallow experience. I, and I agree. I, I agree with it being not a great game. I spent some time playing it this week. Weekend, but more importantly, just seeing how much it's permeated everything. Like I our was, salespeople are playing it. Yeah, salespeople. Yeah, I, I was on a bus and there were four separate people that didn't yep. appear to be together, all playing it around me. Yep. I was at a bar for a UFC event and all these guys that were getting angry, yelling about Brock Lesnar, or also yelling about the fucking slow poke or whatever they found. Um, I went to a restaurant and there was a couple playing it at their table. I went to a park. I met tons of people at this park. Like I probably saw forty or fifty people in this park walking around, clearly playing the game. At one point, I was on a lit in a lift going to the UFC event, and I just saw three like teenage uh, kids walking with their phones out, all with charging cables going to their pockets. And I unrolled the lift window, and I just go, "Pokemon!" I go, "Yep!" Like everyone's playing this. It's, fucking it's thing. My mom really and my dad insane. both texted me about it. They've yeah. never texted me to be like, "Hey, what's the deal with this game? Like, should we buy stock in Nintendo?" Asking all these questions. Oh, like, so like they've heard that they're not like too late for that. Um, but like okay. they. Barely marketed that thing. Like there, but, you know, there were a couple trailers or whatever, yeah. and like they didn't need to. I you mean, got into you know, that beta, yeah. But like the extent right. to which it is spread to, because like Pokemon is like you know revered and and has a huge fan base or whatever. But like it seems like it is spread way beyond the people who care about Pokemon. Well, you have to, to remember like, the people that, like, who don't play games at all. Like Pokemon has been around for so long that the number of people who care about Pokemon is fucking immense. I guess Especially, so, like, but... this game taps into the first 150. This is, like, Gen 1 Pokemon. Right, right. So it's perfectly mm. suited to people that were kids when that game came out. Because now it's like, oh, yeah, Squirtle, motherfucker! Right. Yeah, which is like... exactly what I said when I launched it. I said, oh, yeah, Squirtle, motherfucker! Sure, but people like... that have nostalgia for back when they played it back in the day, but maybe haven't kept up. They don't. They didn't buy a 3DS. They're, no, they're, not, they're not buying not consoles. Or why? Oh no, like, I mean, they I'm have not, an iPhone. Oh, the bike is going to change everything. Yeah, like fucking whatever. No, I'm not they're... denying that they that they got all of those people. But like Drew said, like I. I... Find it hard to believe that all of our salespeople were giant Pokemon fans growing mm. up. You know, like it feels like it has spread. It's that like, age. Like man. Dan's mom certainly didn't grow up with Pokemon. You know, my like mom's it is, never once asked me about a video game ever. Like it has and spread. She... It has spread so far beyond even what the Pokemon fandom is at this point. Like it's it's it, kind of hard to comprehend. Uh, can you think of another game that has come out that you have heard so much about in public from unexpected people never, and places? Like never. I don't it's, think ever. Yeah. Ever. It's like you go to really a park crazy. and. It, Fucking half the people in the park, and also there's more people in the park than you've ever seen, yeah. are running around on their phones. Catch, like, I was walking by a lake, and I heard a bunch of kids talking about, like, oh, I know there's supposed to be Psyducks around here. And I was like, oh, yeah, down by the lake there, go down <laughs> by the shore, a bunch of Psyducks there. Like, weird conversations with strangers. Yeah. Like, I, see, it, I see people posting, like, videos on Instagram of, like, rival gyms rolling up on them, yeah. and, like, oh, it's getting kind of heated and stuff. Like, it's crazy. And, I mean, and, and I deleted it. Um, like, I, I have mixed feelings about this, because I deleted it and reinstalled it a couple times, because... I don't want it to be this thing that, you know, if I'm just walking to work from the bus stop or whatever, I don't want to be staring at my phone the entire time. But I think it is cool if you are making a plan out of it. Like, hey, it's Sunday afternoon, we got a couple hours, let's go to the park and let's go Pokemon hunting. That's the thing we're doing. Yeah. Like, like I, I went on a hike over the weekend, did not look at my phone the entire time because, like, we were focused on, like, the hiking and not, like, stopping every 15 seconds to fucking catch another fucking If you, if you like, analyze your behavior patterns as you play this game in, like, a city environment or whatever, it's like, you're walking five feet, you stop, you walk another yeah. five feet, you turn yeah. 180 yeah. Like degrees, that stuff, you yeah. start turning around in place, like, you look like a lunatic. Yeah, it's when I caught myself doing that on but the walk to work. if everybody's doing it, then it's... Yeah. yeah, and that's when I deleted it. It's like, I don't want to be walking to work and be like, oh, I gotta walk over to this Poke stop over by this sandwich shop and oh, go over to this mural and spend this thing. Um, but it was kind of cool when I decided to like, yeah, I'm 
going to the park strictly for this purpose, and it was kind of fun running around and meeting people. And the doing novelty this and... of that thing is incredible. Like, yeah, the same yeah. way that Ingress was in a lot of ways. But yeah. this is obviously like you know a much wider appeal. Yeah. than than that ever did. I just, I just wish the game was better. Oh, totally. Yeah, That's... I feel like I'm missing something. Yeah, like, like I, I'm not. To I... catch Pokemon, you, you just slide and throw the ball, right? Yeah, yeah. and like you know, the, the people say there's some technique to it, but at the same time, it's a free to play game, and I've seen people suggest like you know, oh, it's you're going to throw as many balls as the game thinks you need to throw before you get the Pokemon. I threw ten uh, fucking no. so Pokemon you, balls at a goddamn yeah. so you, so you, so you'll have think, to go buy more. You can tap point. the ball to pick it back up. Also, oh, you can. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, the balls can tap. There's got to be a trick. Um, there's like ten Pokeballs. So the the my my tip here's my okay. fucking Pokemon Go tip: turn off the fucking AR shit. Because, really? Oh, I because, didn't know you could. No. Yeah, and that's and be, a nice novelty though. Well, yeah, but it also means you have to like look around and do all this stuff. When you turn it off, the Pokemon is right there in front of you at all times. Oh, it's always dead center. Yeah, I yes. assume to just put a background no. on it and yeah, you still have I was, always dead center. I was playing it on the bus yesterday and I was sitting in a seat and I was like, wait, what if it decides the Pokemon is like out the window behind exactly. me? What yeah. am I going to do? Like, uh, it just kind of stays there. So I have okay. AR on and I've done it on a moving bus yeah. and it just kind of yeah. stays in space. Regardless of where you're moving. Okay. Yeah. I yeah, caught um, a Weedle this morning. A Weedle? I got a couple of Weedles. In a I got like, nothing but Zubats. I mean, the Weedle was Yeah. My, so so many Zubats. My neighborhood's nothing but Zubats. Yeah. Well, when I went to the park, there's a million different things. Weedles yeah. and Psyducks and Spiros. But then the second I step out, just a billion Zubats. Also, I don't know how much of this is server instability, but it has been incredibly unreliable. Like the one time It'll that freeze. I found a fucking Clefairy, I hit it and it was about to catch it. And then the app just like crashed on yeah, the Yeah. And it's just like a, a still it. image and then yeah, the Pokeball. Yeah, it's and it super freezes. unstable. Yeah. Yeah. That's unfortunate. Uh, which is, is a bummer. I mean, my hope is that obviously this is such a huge thing. This is going to make a ton of money. I hope that they build this out and make something really cool out of it and make more of a game out of it. Yeah, because it is cool. Because the combat, like when you go to take over a gym and actually engage in the real, in the, the combat, like that part is a real bummer. Yeah, I, I already see that stuff. That stuff's just bad. Right. I already see a lot of people who I guess are Pokemon fans saying like, if this is nothing like actual right. Pokemon combat, which is kind of like, awesome. Why wouldn't you just have the same turn-based stuff? I mean, yeah. I guess that takes longer or something, but like, or does that weird... turn off the more casual people that are coming I mean, back that's to what, it? That's, that's uh, maybe, the thinking. but like the... the the combat, if you haven't seen it, it's like you swipe to dodge and tap to attack, and it's real time, and it's yeah. fucking terrible. Like the, it doesn't. You think about like how poorly the app performs when you're just like catching Pokemon and doing this like other stuff. Like trying to actually play a timing game, it's ter it's real bad. Yeah. Uh, so I don't know. That stuff just, I would. That's that that stuff is needs to be better. What yeah, are the I, uh, uh, free to play hooks in this? Uh, you, there are items you can buy that do different things. Like there are lures you can put out at certain Pokestops to make like rare Pokemon stuff. show up, and you can buy those. So if you want to put a lure out, people, yeah, exactly. Yeah. You put the lure out, and, and other players will see it, and then you just straight up rob them, which yeah. is, which has apparently happened. That's right. Right. Yeah, yeah, phone. Yeah, yeah. Supposedly yeah. happened. Yeah. Uh, yeah, supposedly happened. I mean, you know, the, the the news reported that a girl in Wyoming found a dead body, which is great. Uh, the cool. Holocaust Museum had to just put out a notice saying, "Please stop playing Pokemon Go inside here." Yeah. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah. Um, People ain't got no manners. Yeah. I, it, it just, that was it, a business. I would advertise that shit. <laughs> some, <laughs> I mean, yeah. Plenty of them yeah. are. There are yeah. a bunch of, like, yeah. Some of that stuff has been shown to be it's fake. Been, but there's like real estate listings like, that seeing supposedly it take off. Wow. Uh, like this. Especially, especially so fast. Pokemon I think, honor for paying customers only. I thought I saw someone saying that if a game is number one on the top grossing list in the U.S. on iOS, it means that it's bringing in like 1.6 million a day. Yeah, or over two is or what I saw. Like that. For, for is stuff. it a top grossing already? It's yeah, number one. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's number one on Android. And then and yeah, iOS. then you add in Android. You add in the other countries. It still hasn't completely rolled out yet. Like it's. Fuck, that, that's man. impressive because I, I well, I'm not even level five yet. I haven't even done the gym thing yet. But Jimmy. like, I haven't seen any at least egregious. Uh, upsell stuff. Right. Like, like it's, yeah, yeah, like, it's not like gross sell, stuff they, at all. They sell the Pokeballs that you throw to catch the Pokemon, but like I have over 200 of those. They're right everywhere. Like, 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 every you don't really like need four. to buy It depends those. on where you live. Yeah, uh, that's so true. being mm. up in the suburbs, uh, there's way less stuff to do. Mm. And when I we drove out to the middle of nowhere to you know go to an actual park and there was jack shit in terms of like Pokestops mm. or whatever. Like it was just flat land, nothing for miles. Uh, huh. Driving, walking, I mean, anything just out, out there. So you know, if you live out in the sticks, there's very little to do in this game. I wonder if there's weird server stuff going on right now, because I saw tons of people tweeting that, like, they went to Golden Gate Park, and there's just a ton there. And uh, Tim Turry went out there this weekend and didn't find a single Pokemon after specifically walking yeah, around the Golden the Gate server, Park. With the, if the servers have been jacked. That must have been what happened. Yeah, yeah. Like, like half the time when I open it, like, it doesn't populate the map with any icons. Like, yeah. it's oh, okay. super janky. Yeah, oh. that stuff's been... Stuff's been rough, but whatever. That's it's, it's way bigger than they thought how, it was. How much be. of this, like obviously, like the Pokemon name brings people in, but how much of this do you think is just like 
98% of the people's first experience with geocaching. It's like mm. a lot of yeah. people just have never I'm seen sure. this in like a fun huge. app before. Yeah, right. Like it, even, was, it was a very uh, enthusiastic Yeah, community. like even, even Ingress seemed always seemed yeah. like a pretty niche thing. Totally, like, yeah. I mean, like, I, it, like I said, it's an incredibly novel thing. Like mm-hmm. you're, you're walking around the world and doing this stuff. Like I, I think that's, I think that stuff's awesome. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, I just wish that they had built a better game around those hooks. So, so I think that'll be the thing. Like that'll be the test, right? Is how long will people stick with it? Yeah. Considering that what is there seems kind of shallow, or, or how quickly will they be able to build onto it? Uh, or, to keep or those people. you know, or what, what what is their actual path? Like I, <clears throat> I don't know. It's weird. Yeah, there's already like articles popping up of people going back looking at the original trailer and saying like, oh, here's like half a dozen features they promised in that first trailer that aren't in the game. And, you know, it's, this, this drop while I was in Japan. Yeah, and it's like it doesn't exist there yet, and I'd never seen a trailer. I didn't know anything about it. So I'm just like looking at my Twitter and I'm seeing like pictures of people like tweeting pictures of the park they're at mm-hmm. and people staring at their, I'm like, I have no idea what's happening, right? It's yeah. like my Twitter is all Pokemon. It's fucking alien invasion while you were gone. <laughs> like, <laughs> it's like I, the first time I've, like I haven't had a chance to check it out until today. So I'll probably download it tonight and mess around with it. But yeah, it's just like as someone who doesn't know anything about it. And seeing what it's done, like the net effect it's had, it reminds me of that Star Trek Next Generation yep. yeah, episode. Yeah, the game. Totally. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Where it's like slowly taking over the whole yep. world. It's like, ugh. Yeah, it's, it's, and I haven't had any of the social stuff. I mean, being up in the suburbs, like I, so I spent a little time, like, or I was, I was out in a car for a while too and drove around to some of the gyms, uh, which those are the areas where you kind of take over for your team and, and hold it down, you know, if you want to bang Bs or Cs or, or yellows or whatever you want into. Yeah. Um, and all these people are like, oh man, that we're hanging out here and there's like 50 people here and they're all playing. I'm like, oh, let's go out and see what's up. Went over to this gym, nothing. Huh. I, I the the only interaction I had with a, a stranger was I had it open in my car and I was at a drive through uh, getting some drinks and the guy was like oh Pokemon I'm playing that and I went yeah and yeah. then drove away and <laughs> and that was it I so, saw people tweeting me from like rural southwestern Kansas saying, right oh it's a phenomenon here everyone yeah playing. like seeing people like oh we're walking around it's three in the morning and cops are driving by and saying like you guys are catching them Pokemon <laughs> I'm like what the fuck happened to the world this is frightening <laughs> and not at all what I experienced playing the game over the weekend so but it's kind of cool seeing this I think like seeing I, yeah, everyone totally. talk about it like I said in a way that I've never seen people talk about a video game Pac Man. Okay. That's the one. Is there a song about Pokemon Go yet? Mm. There are songs about Pokemon. There, there was mm. a sign, the, the most visible sign on Raw last night was Pokemon Go brought me here. And then there was a Blastoise with Brock Lesnar's head on it. I saw someone that's have the psychopathic good. record Hatchet Man in the crowd. That so, was also pretty you know, visible the whole that's time. That's pretty much, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's also Pokemon <laughs> Go's fault, I'm sure. That's the audience. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It, it's, it's just cool to watch, I think. I don't think it's a great game by any yeah, means. Yeah. yeah. I, I actually deleted it after the security stuff. Um, which they they came out which, and said, yeah. like, yeah, which obviously, you know. And I revoked they're, they're it, gonna, so I'm probably going to jump back in. Yeah, but, so uh, we'll I, I, think it's, I think it's great that this concept is getting out to this many people because I want to see more and yeah. better games yeah. that do this sort of stuff. Whether yeah. it's Pokemon Go or whether someone else kind of figures something out, like, I would love to... Like, that was some of the early iPhone stuff was, like, it wasn't. There weren't even games most of the time, but like people that were trying to take like the the location based mm-hmm. stuff into account and say like you know like like yik yeah or uh, like yeah, is now, but like like hey we've got walls for actual physical locations and you can go and post messages, but only while you're there. Uh, I just thought that stuff was so awesome back then and and had so much potential and and this will probably be the thing that leads to more developers kind of exploring yeah. Uh, I hope so. That sort of stuff. So I, I, I'm hopeful that even if Pokemon Go doesn't eventually get to where I hope it gets, that someone will get something there. Yeah. But, Definitely opens the door for more of that stuff. Yeah. Uh, like I want to show up at a set location and beat the shit out of somebody <laughs> and take their phone. That's mm. the game. That's the actual game. Okay. okay. All right. Uh, Dan, you got anything else? 